Hi friends, today you are going to learn SolidWorks Rectangle Sketching Tool Tutorial. This video contains different types of rectangle sketch tools and how to draw it in the SolidWorks user interface and also be friendly with the rectangle property manager. Let's start. Here you are going to see how to draw a rectangle using the corner rectangle sketch tool. Let's begin with the tutorial. Let's start with opening the new part by Here is the rectangle property manager. Here we select on the corner rectangle tool, and also you can click on the add dimension and add construction line. Then we will see on the later sort of exercises. And here you can see the existing relation. Here no relation with the are existent. That's why it's empty. You can add relations, horizontal, vertical, fix. Horizontal. This is vertical symbol. Here one relation with the origin because I selected the corner. This origin. It's a coincident uh, symbol is over here. Okay. You can also select if it, you are selected for construction the all rectangle will change to the construction line that we not need up and here you can see the <coughs> sorry the four corners position on the graphic the sketch interface this the origin point and the other three corner points are here the x y coordinates are here just click ok to make the rectangle the corner rectangle for adding dimension you can click on smart dimension here you can see the it will turn to these two lines turn to the black that means it is defined because it's coincident with the origin that means a relation existed i'm selecting just um, giving a hundred for it and now see the other one is defined yeah it's completely turned to black that means it's fully defined this way you can make a corner rectangle next you are going to see how to draw a center rectangle sketch in the SolarWorks graphics interface so that I am selecting a front plane here you can select the center rectangle from the sketch command manager also you can go to the tools menu sketch entities and the center rectangle here are two points are there one is at the center of the rectangle and the two is the other one corner the diagonally opposite corner of the rectangle so I, here i am selecting center as the origin the 0 0 x y coordinate and drag it out more and click on it somewhere some other point second corner here you can see the relations the vertical relation the horizontal relation is it's a coincident relation these are two construction lines are going to uh, going to the diagonal point is through the center to each corner each and opposite corners and uh, 
can also see the relations you can also completely make by clicking it on a uh, for construction uh, see for construction purpose and uh, other all other points here is the center point is we selected it as a origin so it's being zero zero and the other four po corner points x y coordinates are shown here and click ok to make it for applying dimension and just give here it's completely blue because it's not defined completely here we are going to play dimension See, after applying the dimension, it turned into the color black. That means it's fully defined. If you click on it, we are selecting fully. The property manager will show the selectability. Uh, it's not, uh, it's for construction. That's it. If you uncheck the construction, it becomes a line. So we can delete the line, you can see the rectangle. That's all about how to draw a center rectangle using the center rectangle sketch tool. Another rectangle tool is the three point corner rectangle sketch tool. For drawing a three point corner rectangle sketch tool, that's different. Entities and three point it's a three point rectangle sketch tool because it, uh, we have to select the three points, the three corner points for drawing the rectangle. That means if you are selecting the one corner of the project, and then point, next point, drag it. can see the lines good it seems uh, equally I mean same as the uh, corner rectangle tools um, property manager having changed the, the all those indicating four corners and the only thing we have to drive it using a three corner that means you can uh, select different different points or Okay, let's see how to use the three point center rectangle sketch tool in this all work interface. Here I already selected the front plane at the three point center rectangle sketch tool. You can also access it from the tools, sketch entity. The first point is the center. Next, you can see how to use the parallelogram sketch tool for making the parallelogram in the SOLIDWORKS. Here I am selecting the different front plane. Then here I click the
like this you can uh, make the parallelogram in uh, SOLIDWORKS user interface I hope you could understand different rectangle sketch tools and how to draw a rectangle in SOLIDWORKS I love to hear from you guys and feel free to comment and submit your thoughts and uh, please like and subscribe to get new videos and visit SOLIDWORKS tutorials for beginners.com for learning solar works for